What are these? What's up everybody? Welcome back to Edible Fitness. Now you already know I love to eat spicy food, so today is not going to be any different. I'm also not alone. I'm here with my friend, David. Hi guys. <laughs> <laughs> today we are going to be making, he's actually going to be helping me make some enchiladas. Exactly. Yes. They're going to be spicy, not hot. I don't know. Okay. You will tell me. No, you tell me. I don't want, you know, burning my mouth. That's, that's not cool. Well, what can I say? Okay, yeah. Mexican people like to suffer while they're eating. Okay. All right. That's we'll see what happens. Anyway, let's get started. it is not that green so we'll need to add more uh, more uh, tomatillos entonces vamos a pedir esto ok vamos a echar un sorry but uh, let's add uh, let's add two why not why not and then just to make it better because this is this step is very important if you don't do it you gonna get real enchiladas. You have to when you mix it. You have to scream, "Viva Mexico!" <laughs> okay, so now that it's finished, we just add it to pot, right? Exactly. Okay. All of it. All of it. All of it. Look for it and scream. Remember. <laughs> Viva Canada! <laughs> Mexico, sorry, sorry. It's a habit. It smells really good. You did a good job. <laughs> Mexicans are always doing great jobs. Yes, I think so. Uh, so, stir it for how long would you say? Uh, until it gets thicker. Okay. okay. All right, so we're gonna stir this, let it get thicker, and then we'll be back.
next is now that we've shredded the chicken, uh, I'm just gonna add it quickly to a frying pan with a little bit of uh, coconut oil to it. Add that there. And now, you don't need to add salt because it already has the salt added from the boiled water. But I am gonna add some uh, parsley and black pepper as well. And David, what are you gonna do? I'm going to put the tortillas here and that what's the name for you? On the pan? Pan. Oh yes, the pan. pan. <laughs> sure. How much put it here? Then flip it. How long does that normally take? Like uh, I don't know, like mm, 15 seconds. Oh, okay. 20 seconds. Nice. Then you just flip it. That's amazing. It's amazing. It is amazing. <laughs> I know. You have to try this. Absolutely, it's an excellent dish. Now, we, I also have to say, because this is not authentic Mexican, so I'm not doing everything exactly by the book. So these are not corn tortillas, which is what would normally be used. Exactly. Right? So these are actually whole wheat. Keeping it on a little healthier tip. And I'm also not using sour cream. No. 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 Not a fan. Not a fan. I know. I'm sorry. What can I say? Yeah. <laughs> You're destroying the enchilada. <laughs> I'm sorry. I'm sorry. No, but they will be good. That's it. So, of course, now we got a taste test. See if my version of the enchiladas stacks up to, you know, a good version of it. Give it a try here. Looks good. Looks good. It does look really good. Oh my gosh. Oh wow. Mm -hmm. Yeah? Mm -hmm. Okay, good. <laughs> so, I'm gonna finish this. You will make yours. And we'll see you next time on Edible Fitness. Fitness. <laughs>